Hi, this is Jonathan. How are you guys doing? In today's video, I'm going to feature this guitar from Vox. This beautiful guitar from Vox. This is the Bobcat V90 Bixby.
I want to thank City Music for Seren's guitar for review, especially Mike who drove all the way here. Great guy. Yeah, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to this channel. Let's go through the appointments. Uh, this guitar features a maple um, plywood for its body, for its front and back. Really resonant. Yeah. Also features two F holes with uh, bindings inside to accentuate the form, the shape. And you have bindings here, white bindings on the side. Really nice. Also features a mahogany neck with an Indonesian ebony fretboard. Uh, nut width of 43 mm. These are, I guess, these are like medium jumbo or maybe just normal uh, frets, nickel frets. Not sure about the uh, fretboard radius though. I'm thinking like, I'm guessing it's like 13 or 12, you know. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, it also features Grover's tu uh, Grover tuners right here. These are really nice uh, black tuners with uh, kind of brass uh, open gear. Nice touch, nice color coordination. All right. And I like the headstock. The headstock features kind of a bluish uh, abalone uh, inlays, really nice. And the fretboard too, the fretboard inlays are really nice too. Yeah. And the uh, white bindings are across the fret. Yeah. Nice, attractive looking guitar. And it features a big speed B700 um, system here in all black. <laughs> right? Uh, you gotta see it in real life. You gotta see it in live to appreciate the beauty of it. It's all black. Hardware is like something that's really sexy. And a tunematic bridge right here. Okay, this guitar also features uh, a pair of V90 soap box pickups, right? Uh, basically, they like you know, the P90s. And uh, nice. Uh, you have uh, two volume control, one for each pickup, and two tone controls. And you also have three way switch. Right. Nice uh, Vox uh, Bobcat uh, pig guard here. Okay. And uh, then the Bixby. The Bixby works beautifully. You can hear that, right? So that's because of the nut. Uh, this guitar uh, does not belong to me, so it's going back to the shop. So. I am. I don't want to cut the nut. I don't want to file the nut. I don't want to do anything, any modification within that. If this guitar is mine, I would like file it, uh, according, especially for a third and fourth string, because this is like the Gibson kind of a uh, stock, a headstock, you know. And uh, this angle here is the killer part. So I would file, you know, the the nut according to where the string is coming from, so to alleviate uh, the string tension and avoiding the strings being caught up in the nut, right? Uh, that would do the trick. And with a bit of loop, that would do the trick definitely. And then I'll be playing away with the big speed. I think the big speed works. Right? Um, but then again, you know, I, 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 I really love the big speed, but this is not like a tremolo, uh, a full blown tremolo system like what you find in most of my guitars. These are all really, su really subtle uh, kind of playing style, like unique. Stuff like that. And not really like, you know, the whole. The whole, uh, yeah, real subtle like, and it's nice. It's nice. I, I like the whole get up of this. This whole appearance of it. These V nineties are really great pickups. You know, they have the warmth, they have the bottom, and they have the bite. And putting this on this Bobcat uh, is a good, uh, different thing, a, a different uh, take on on how a a, a semi solid should be because most semi solid would have like humbuckers and they're all warm sounding or jazzy sounding like uh, this gives you the option of having that at the same time giving you the option of playing something more bright like country rock pop nice even for church you know i think this guitar looks great in church um i don't know about a black though but i would i would play in church <laughs> yeah nice uh, i like the guitar I like how it plays. This is like a nice, comfortable C, slim C shape. Really easy to get along, uh, to get along and around it. And of course, the, the V90s are nice. Yeah. So let me know what you think about this guitar. Yeah, right? and leave a comment and comment section down below. And again, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel and be uh, notified by pressing that bell of future videos. Right, and be part of the Patreon to support this channel. I need the support. So I want to thank each and every one of them for the love, their support, their friendship above all. Thank you guys. So in the meantime, you guys uh, 
stay safe. There are a lot more videos coming up because there are so many guitars in my in my living room. <laughs> so I'm gonna take my time and review those. So just watch out for them. So in the meantime, again, practice safe distancing. Pull on your mask if you need to go out, and be safe. Right? Arrivederci. God bless.